Okay folks, today I just want to share how to how to create a train data for OCR the Sarah. Yep. Um, before uh, we have seen that uh, so many mm, tutorial, but in this case I would like to share my version. Maybe it's uh, it's useful for you. Okay, first thing, first step. We gonna need some tools actually. Uh, something like if you see here, the the Tesseract trainer. I will attach uh, the link on the description. So, uh, I will. Uh, we gonna need to download uh, this version, the latest version. So I recommend this latest version, and then because we want to. I because I want to create a seven segment train data, so I download this fun and then I will install this fun. Okay, uh, I will download that fun and let's see here. Yes, this one. Okay, um, and and then next we need to download two more tools. Uh, I'm gonna choose this one, GTest Box Editor 2.0 version. So, and then the uh, this one, Fiat, Fiat OCR. Uh, you can download this one also. Uh, first, I will clear all of this uh, to make sure that we will start over. We will start from the first thing. Okay, let me start. We will download this one. Okay, uh, and then next we will download this this one. Yeah, because I have downloaded uh, all the files that we require. Uh, you can see uh, I will download this is a duplicate. This is a duplicate. This is a duplicate also. This three uh, tools I have downloaded, and then the seven segment. You can install now, install for all user because I already installed by okay, it's okay, I installed again. Okay, now next we're gonna copy I'm gonna copy uh, cut everything for uh, to I already create a, a new folder in my desktop so segment OCR I'm gonna paste here so we can work to our own folder I'm gonna Okay, so uh, first we're gonna install this one. I'm gonna extract this. Install blah 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 Fiat OCR. No, I think this program is uh, required to test uh, whether our train data is working or not. So, I mean, okay, after we install this. Just everyone, maybe. Okay, done. And then next, we go back to the desktop, our folder. Uh, we will extract this. Okay, uh, this tool is uh, required to create a diff file. Okay, so um, mm, and then this uh, this one I will extract. Like this one, to serve 0 0.4. Okay, like this, this one. Okay, first we're gonna open this, uh, this G bot G test box editor. We can double click train that bat. Okay, don't forget to create our txt file. Uh, I already I have create uh, this file. Uh, actually, to train the seven segment, uh, because I want to, uh, I want to the train data recognize uh, this as a seven segment. Uh, okay, so uh, which one is this? Okay, we go to TIFF box generator and input, which is the TXT file, and we can see here. Maybe I just put. 
this is the fun that we have installed the Serac and I, I'm gonna choose bolt italic I'm gonna set maybe 10 maybe too small or you can see yep I think no problem mm, no problem so we am gonna choose uh, this uh, 7 sec 7 sec this is a prefix language language code whether you want to set your language as a se seg segment or whatever so but this one you can let it like that okay so and the output uh, we gotta choose uh, seven segment OCR file and then set actually there is one button one more button hiding on this I'm gonna drag it I'm gonna undock this and generate okay you have to make sure everything is already set and generate okay so the TIFF file already generated we can see on our folder the TIFF file is this one the TIFF file is already created you can see here okay so now we're gonna check on the box editor open and we choose our t file and bum you see here and okay and everything is okay I think so uh, you can check uh, which character is not uh, listed on this one and you can change the position but in this case I just want to make it quick so you can so you can use this okay finish after this we're gonna use the setup file okay I'm gonna close this file okay next we're gonna use this uh, setup test, test setup the trainer exit file okay I'm gonna double click to open this one. Uh, first thing first, we go to option and tesseract option. This tesseract path, which means that whether where is the tesseract.exe file is located. Uh, we can see on the G G test box editor in here tesseract OCR. We can find the tesseract.exe file is located here. So you just need to copy this one and then paste in here done okay and you set the language as as, as eg okay it it's uh, same uh, like when you when we create the tiff file okay and then save and the new project we create new project first we have to create a new project first here and Maybe I, I'm gonna put a new folder like a training. Uh, we call it as a seven a segment. Okay, I'm gonna save and add train the image. So we go to our folder desktop seven segment OCR and select the TIFF file that we have created. Open. And define click define font properties. We have to make sure that this font name is same as we same as when we create the TIFF file. Okay, same. Okay, save and changes. Okay. Train the Xerox. Okay, training complete. Uh, first, we're gonna go to our folder. Where are you? Training folder train data and everything is here but we're gonna need to combine all of this to create the train data or something like that combine test data okay you can see here the test data the train sec the train data has been created on this folder but we're gonna need to test this uh, train data so I'm gonna choose I'm gonna select the other tools maybe I can copy 
this one and as we had installed the Fiat OCR you have to remember where you install the Fiat OCR is install and select the test data and paste here okay so now the SEG is a language code okay now I go to the uh, the fiat OCR.exe okay. I just need to open this one whether my train data is working or not uh, I don't know will be working or not uh, okay you can select uh, I have uh, some feature uh, I have some feature here but maybe I'm gonna test this one you open uh, okay. see okay you can see but uh, this one is not uh, accurate enough because um, you have to ref uh, tune uh, what we call fine tuning fine tuning okay so uh, but at least this is the the basic guide how you can tra uh, train data for uh, the Tesseract OCR and then that train that you can use on the uh, visual basic right okay that's all folks uh, I hope you enjoy uh, you can uh, uh, you can do some fine tuning and more exploration for this OGR train data so thanks for watching guys uh, see you bye